Hey, good morning hey. to all you glorious shooter pickers. Oh my goodness, it is time for March, March Madness. Madness 2023. And we are going to be revealing the bracket today. That's right. And then you guys got all your guesses in for how many Mr. Rangel will make. Right, and it was kind of interesting. Mr. Rangel kind of didn't understand what kind of free throws I we know. were going to be making. I know, he was making. making a free throw. Yes, with a body. Instead of free throws. So we had to set him straight on That's the... Right exact sport that we were doing not wrestling but basketball and yes. so then he transitioned into he did a great job with the basketball. Great job. so we have so we have four, four brackets, brackets right we have the coffee house bracket mm -hmm. the dutch bros bracket the isabel's bracket and the shaboba bracket right so we're honoring different um coffee Lenders, house yeah. and boba establishments in town this year last year we did pizza places we if did I'm pizzas not mistaken. yeah so this year we're going to have four different brackets where you can get the beverage of your choice. So. That is right. So I'm looking through the first round and it's like the kids made a, and the kids and teachers yeah. made some great picks. Right. But I would have to say that some people had a lot more confidence in Mr. Angle than others. That's so. true. I see some pretty low yeah. level confidence too. Mm -hmm. So should we look at the coffee house bracket Yeah, let's look at the coffee house bracket. Mm. So coffee house bracket is quite interesting. We have some guesses that are quite lofty like Mia yes, Beltran has. I know. 15. 15. I know. Um, I know. That's in my territory. Yeah. And then we have as low as four. Four. I yes. Skylar. I see a couple of them. At least so, one. Yeah. Yeah, it's quite interesting how some people really think that Mr. Angle will do well and others yep. I think that he's so just well. throwing a three free throw. So do you yeah. have any idea? Like, what do you think? You know, I have no idea what Mr. Angle. Yeah, I, I see that, you know, maybe, you know, a Laura Choa or a Tip Panini can yeah. come out of that bracket. Well, yeah, you Tip know. and Caleb, they're, they're a nine and six. I mean, I... I I'm hoping that Mr. Angle does well. Yeah, I hope he makes more than that, but yeah. you never know. I mean, it's, he's a wrestler by trade. It's anybody's guess. I That's mean, right. Fifty percent would be kind of my uh, goal. Like if I, I could would make think half, so. And yeah. I'm hoping that Mr. Angle can do that as well. Yeah, maybe he'll shoot better than Shaq. Yeah, we'll we'll see. That's right. We will <laughs> see. We will see. Right. How about the uh, Dutch Bro bracket? Dutch Bro bracket is. Um, interesting as well so there's some low guesses like big uh, daddy perez like i don't know but i know big daddy perez was our shooter last year mm -hmm. he doesn't have a whole lot of confidence in his boss he that is true four for round one so. yeah but there's another one down there Layla sanchez only guessed two yeah uh, you know that was the lowest that i'd seen i don't know i mean big daddy it is your boss so that is true you gotta saying, be better to the boss i i'm a little a little disappointed in yeah. that guess, but, but then, then you got on the high and you got Jaden Crow. I know, 14. 14. I mean, that's that's um, she she's has, doing well. she has confidence in Rangel, yes, very, so very we'll, confident. we'll see how that bracket plays out. And then mm -hmm. we have Isabel's up Isabel's, at the top, yes. and up at the top of that bracket is last year's winner, Chris yep. Musman. And yep, he, Mr. Musman, he has some confidence in his boss, 11. Yes. Uh, uh, Scott Sigma, 14. I know. Uh, um, but, you know, you got then Grace Grinder at four. Right. And then you have our vice principal, Alicia Vache. She only has five. five. I know. That's 25%. Wow. I'm kind of worried about the vice principal. Right. So there is a whole plethora of guesses there. I'm, I know. I, it's got to be tough. It's I mean, hard to say. Who and, knows? I know. It's kind of know. funny. And but, then Mike Ruland and Lexi Parrish, 12 and 13. That's like, really that's, close. That's a close one. So we'll see what happens in round one. But Yep. Yep. And then we have the Shaboba mm -hmm. bracket. And we have quite a few, like Madison Lopez, 17. Like, Ooh. She has a lot of confidence. That's great confidence. Where then Brad Eldridge only gets three. I so, know. Three. I don't know. There's... It's amazing. But I, I think the TID councilman, David Yonan, you know, might, uh, you know, his picks look pretty good. And yeah. so do, you know, the curling state champion pick mm -hmm. with Mr. Geed looks pretty right. good. You know, that's kind of, that's, that's good stuff. It's just hard to say, um, you know, we really won't know until we see the No, I see the first. I haven't seen any of them, so I have no idea. Um, but it, it, the, the guesses are all over the board. Like yep. there, there's either really strong confidence in our amazing principal, Keith Rangel, or there's no confidence at all. Not a lot of confidence. You know? And yep. my hope is that he surprises everyone yes, with his mine too. 
with his form and his free throw shooting skills. So, That's right. Will he be better than Shaq? I don't know. Well, he has to be try to be better than you and Big Daddy Perez. Well, that's true. It's because, pretty hard to be better than me. I shot well, pretty well. Well, I'm just going to brag, you know. I mean, <laughs> Why not? some good rounds there. I mean, right. I know I, I was I played impressed. basketball my whole life. Yeah, and, you know, so Mr. I, I'm not. still going to say that I was absolutely wowed by your performance three years ago. I can't yeah, believe so it's been I. three years. I know the Elmo Barn was good to me. Yes, it was. So... The first round will be happening on Tuesday. So Tuesday, it's coming up really fast. I'm not sure what time of the day. I'm thinking sometime in the afternoon. I don't want to make any promises as far as the time. It'll be a busy day, but we'll get that That's out right. there. Hopefully around the time that school's out so that you can see how Mr. Keith Wrangle does in the first round of March Madness. Sounds and good. So stay tuned and the bracket will be posted outside of Mrs. Vache's office on the window so you can go take a look at it and I'll update it after every round. But So how often do the rounds come out? Um, they're going to be coming out pretty much when the actual rounds of March Madness happen. So oh, okay. you know every few days. But we'll announce that when the time comes as far as the specific dates that each round will come out. You better so, pay attention to your super yeah, fan app. Exactly. And our social media. So good luck to all of our participants. Good I luck. I can't wait to see who wins this year's March can't Madness. Can't wait to watch Mr. Randall shoot. Exactly. So we'll just have to wait till Tuesday and see Good luck to does. all of you. Good luck to all of you.